Hey guys, it's Seven Mary Two, and welcome back to Let's Play the Big Brother Challenge Part Two. I am, of course, joined by Four Charles. What's up, dudes? And dudettes. There's dudettes out there too. Um, okay, I'm sorry. I use dudes <laughs> as a as a name for everybody. Yeah, well, it's a group name. Can't necessarily do that anymore. You gotta be a little bit more careful about that these days. <sighs> <laughs> what has the world come to? Yeah, well. Okay. All right. So forewarning. As you can tell by the picture on the screen, our game gonna be real glitchy today. So, um, yeah, we're gonna have fun. Um, so the first thing we were thinking about doing, well, she's gonna go to school today, right? Richard is over there just falling to utter pieces. <laughs> what are you doing, boy? He's having He's eating. a crisis. He's eating a salad, so. Well, that's healthy. Well, at least salads are good. Well, okay, I guess if they don't have lettuce in them. <laughs> <laughs> what do you eat a crouton salad? I mean, doesn't sound that bad to me. <laughs> does, does he have to go to work, or is he gonna go like dance? No, 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 no! Don't go to high school. Yes, come home. You're not allowed to go to school. I forbid it. Bye, sweetie. You can go to school, of course. All right. You are not working until Saturday, so we need to go. Fix your life, because you're a man and you need help. <laughs> <laughs> Was that a bad stereotype? I'm sorry. I'm sorry for all you men out there. Um, but, you know. <laughs> you know. <laughs> yeah, alright. So, what we want to do in this part is um, move house. Because this house Yay. stinks. I'm sorry, Sims team, but it stinks. We put so much time and effort into it, too. Yeah. And it still doesn't look great. I mean, it looks better than right. it did, I not to be proud. the kid room is, like, This the is the best, best room. obviously. There's also um, the one I think we put the most time in. Yeah, definitely. Although, I love his room up here, though. It's, like... It's simple but elegant. Because I love a nice, big, open room. Oh, we didn't paint that wall. Never mind. I'm now frustrated. But it's okay, because we're going to leave, and nobody's going to care. Oh, we're going to make our, our beautiful girl work hard. Um, or I guess study hard is the technical term for it, but, you know. Um, oh, wait, hurt, hurt a minute. Oh, oh yeah. the man's bathing. Can't look, don't look. Oh, it blurs it out. No one oh, looks! Right, fine, <laughs> shield your eyes! <laughs> um, yeah, like these, um, part-time jobs, you don't have to, like, prep or anything, so, because he's a lawnmower. Because you'd have to prep for that somehow. Right. <sighs> I could be a lawnmower. I love mowing the lawn. It's great. Is it relaxing to you? Well, I put my headphones on with music. Uh, so you can just sit there and run. Well, as long as you're riding. If you're pushing, it right. doesn't really work. Because your tablet or phone will just fall everywhere. So. Is it snowing? Because I actually did not notice until just now. It's spring and it's snowing. How far into spring? Oh, it's only day two of spring. All right. All right. Fine. It's, Don't answer it's, the it's, phone. It's, <laughs> it's uh... It's a all right, can you actually bathe a little bit faster? Um, are you having fun? Good, I'm glad. Um, I'm glad he's having fun. I really am. <laughs> so what, are you, what are you doing? You're going to go play with a panda. Honestly, though, same. Get I would play bath. with a panda. Get out of the bath and play with a panda. All right, we're going to go um, look. Dig the outfit. What? I said I dig the outfit. Oh, yeah, well. You gotta okay. Well, he's real mad. You got to love a man with fashion sense. Well, we dress him. Well, that's true. So it's more of a man with a woman's fashion sense. Women's fashion sense. Okay, so. <laughs> so, I mean, he can have some points, but he didn't get all the points. Right. All right, we um found a house to move into, and we're going to see if we can afford it, because I kind of doubt it, but, you know. Uh-oh. Are we going to tell Dad we're moving? That's he's late for school. That's fine. Oh, okay. Are we going to tell Dad we're moving, or are we just going to move and not tell Dad? Let's move and not tell Dad. Or we could just pretend that we were always in the house we're moving to. Or Dad bought it. Missed bubble. Another standardized test. Bora is almost done when she realizes she skipped a bubble near the top. All her answers are one-off. <gasps> Have you ever done that? Yes. 
I but it was only the it was only the part where we were filling out our interest. It wasn't actually the oh, answer. Right. See, so think- kids, when you do standardized tests, bring a ruler so you know which bubble you're on. Or you, you mean you can use your hand? It would work. It's faster if you use a ruler, though. Okay. All right. But I think I've skipped one before, but I don't know if it's ever messed up my other answers. I've just like looked over them and been like, "Oops, missed one." Right, like missed an entire question. Yeah. Who knows there. But I don't think it's ever messed up any of my other answers. Um, she starts to tell the teacher, but realizes she'll have to take the test again. Girl, take it again. <laughs> Always. It's really only for the state. It doesn't affect her grade. Should we, would she confess the mistake or would she just turn it in the way it is? I say confess the, confess the mistake. Yeah, I think that sounds like That's her. That's what she I would do. You Bora tells the teacher what happened and the teacher helps her, helps her, yeah. I can't read. The teacher helps her transfer her answers onto a new form. All right, moving out, kids. <laughs> well, she got a performance gain, I can tell you that. Right. Yep. That's good. Woo. Okay, so it currently says we can't afford it. We have 90, do we have, do we actually have 91,000 or is that from our house? Yeah. We're going to need to save up a little bit. <laughs> we need $216,000. Wow. So, um, scratch that plan for the episode. That's sad. Um, I told you to pause, young man. What, that salad wasn't enough for you? Or you didn't finish it? Like an irresponsible child. All right. You probably didn't eat the lettuce, because the lettuce is gross. <laughs> well, no, there's a tomato in there. Oh, it was also a mushroom in there. That's gross. That's what I call nasty. Is that a mushroom? Yeah, it is. It's very low quality. I'm sorry. But my PC and got that kind of power. So we need to choose a hobby for Richard to make money because this part-time job ain't going to cut it kids. Right. Um, from experience, honestly, the two that I've had the most success with are writing and painting. I know if you get the right plants gardening, you can make a killing, but that's a lot more waiting. Mm -hmm. So writing is good. And why don't we try writing? You try writing? I like writing. All right. So. I um, forgot we had our fish. Yeah, we have a. What's our fish's name? Frederick. Nice. He's going to go play with a panda. Yo, what up, Frederick? What kind of. What kind of. What kinda... Oh, he's a common fish, so. He's a he's tropical a, fish. They're, they're smart, though. Oh, well. They're pretty smart. Well, with a name like Frederick. I mean, I, I mean, hope. with a smart fish, we couldn't call him Bob. Not that if your name is Bob, you're not smart. It just, we needed a smart sounding name. Right. Yeah, right. Not that we need a fish with smart, but hey, we'll just pretend we tried it. Okay, Richard, this is honestly not what we need you to be doing right now. Um, do we have a computer or are we also, literally Also, how, how old is this guy? Do we know? Um, well, he's a teen. Okay. Which means he could be, that part depends on your imagination. He could be anywhere between, I guess, 13 and 19, but he kind of okay. looks like 17, 18, 19. Yeah, I would say almost like probably 17 the, or 18. On the lower, farther end of the spectrum. Um, let's see. Right. Should we just practice or do you want to just go straight for a book? Let's go straight to a book. All right. See what, so see what the happens. only thing we can do is children's. So what I like to do with the when they're writing books is like kind of create a little book series for them. Uh-huh. So should we like create a little book series that he starts? Sure. I mean, what, why not? What, what kind of like children's books would he write we can obviously expand later on but we got to do a children's book for now what kind of children's books would he write? i know in my other let's play my girl is writing a series of detective tiger it's mm-hmm. great marcus flex i don't want to join your club <laughs> go away <laughs> please <laughs> all right um so what kind of books do we want to write a story about Puppies. There's puppies going to be the main character, and okay. the puppy goes through a bunch of misadventures. Okay. Um, we need a name for our puppy. It should start with a P, because alliteration Definitely. is the best. Nice. Um, should it be a girl puppy or a boy puppy? Um, girl puppy, and then we can make it off of his sister. Oh, that's cute. Or, what if we did a an animal or a critter that has, that starts with a B, because mm-hmm. then we could actually name the critter Bora. Bora Bunny? Bora the Bunny? Oh, 
That's cute. We're doing it. <laughs> Four of the bunny. Um, what should the adventure be? Uh, How about a mine shaft. What can she do in the mine shaft? She could search for gems. Gem searcher? That doesn't sound right. The search for gems. Search for pretty gems. <laughs> we don't need a description. It's fine. So the the title describes the book, okay. Wait, let's 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 alliterate, shall we? The listening gems. Well, if it's a children's book, we don't want a big name. What's so, what about glittery? Okay, glittery gems. Like that was my first thought, but glittery. Yeah. Okay, glittery gems. I mean, it doesn't totally alliterate, but it kind of does. So, there you go. Right away, my boy. Now we need to decide how much Look of this. Look at that speed typing. Oh I wow! I wish I could type as fast as her. That is skills, fam. Should Bora invite over classmate Lucas? Sure. Come on over, Lucas. Bora has returned home with a school is project. He taking a selfie. <gasps> he is taking a selfie, boy. And wait, we've been up to a B. Yay! Oh, guys, what's that found in? And by that I mean Bora, because are we talented? It well, depends on the subject matter. Let's not brag. You tell me if I'm talented, and I'll tell you if, you, if you're talented. <laughs> See, it would depend fun? on the thing, though. Yeah. For the game of social skills, neither of us are talented. Dude, did Lucas show up, or did he just, like, be He like, might have fallen off the cliff. Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I think Lucas died. <laughs> it's fine. Um, what do you, wait, hold on, hold on, sweets. We need you to, um, I know, I'm really, I'm, I am a strickler. I make them do their homework as soon as they get home, as long as they're in a good mood. But then we can get her and Richard to do that together, because it'll be cute. But, I almost feel like they'd be the kind of people that would, like, come home and be like, they'd, like, have to say hi, have to, in air quotations, but, you know. That takes too long in The Sims, so even though I pretend my families are loving families, they, they can't be. All right, we finished our book. Woo! -hoo. Can we make a copy of it? Because I really want to. Oh, we can read it to Bora, dude. We gotta read the book we dedicated to Bora. To Bora, honestly. I think we'll do that after she's done her homework. Or are we just gonna do it now and not care? I feel like we should wait till she's done her homework. This house is so dark, honestly. The top of the house is dark and the bottom is, like, ex overexposed. It's great. Richard, where are you? Probably taking more selfies. Probably. <laughs> yoo -hoo. Oh, we even got a French press. Look at that. Oh, we fancy. Yeah, we doing it nice. now. I actually don't like French press coffee. It's too strong. Oh, really? Yeah. I just put a lot of creamer in it. <laughs> well, I do that anyhow. Right. <laughs> but. Oh, yo, dude, Lucas! He's probably going up to use our computer, because, you know. Well, wait, then we can get Richard to read it to... Okay, he's just... Is he actually up here reading to nobody? Richard, I'm sorry. You can... His read. heart is broken. <laughs> yeah, because he's kind of being dumb right now. <laughs> Actually, he can come down here and help her with her homework. Dude, that's cute. Come down here and help her with her homework. Even though she's a smarty and can do it all by herself. But homework is always easier when you have someone helping you. Yeah, of course. Even if you're just talking to them and you're like, oh, now that I've explained it to you, it makes yeah. sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just having somebody else there to help you work through it is just so much better. Are you coming? You are, like, old before your time, dude. Nice watch, by the way. Um, I need you to go start working on that project, and we will, um, actually, let's find Lucas and call him down here so he can help us, too. Hold on, Richard. Yo, dude, Lucas, kid. Um, can we, oh, we can't call him over, he's too far away. Oh, well, let's go introduce ourselves to Lucas. Acquire the mental skill. Nice. She's gonna be a smart cookie. Yeah. Alright, now let's see if we can go down here. Maybe Lucas will help us, too. You never know. And it can be a fun friends project. Alright, so who who gives an eight-year-old child a science experiment where she has to deal with open vials 
of chemicals. Somebody who's not very smart, apparently. She just looks real proud of herself, though. And Richard is just playing with the tape measure. Where, where's Lucas? Dude, Lucas, did you come down? Did I see you, or are you still up with the computer? I feel like he's still up with the computer. Nope, he's being a good boy. Can we, like, ask him to help? Because that would be fun. Fun friends time. Can she do it from here? Dude, friend, are you going to come help us? <gasps> Wait, he might. He coming, dude? Y'all, I think he is. Oh, he's gonna come help! That's so cute! It'll be a bonding experience. Friend bonding! Hey, you never know. I mean, kids grow up. What do you a guys think? A bright future awaits let's, you. Let's put a poll. Would you guys ship Bora and Lucas in the future? Mm -hmm. Even though they just met. Well, no, I'm talking about in the last part. True. So they've known each other for like three days. It's fine. That that's legit. <laughs> it's not long enough yet, but you know they got their whole lives ahead of them. Yeah, and I love his boots. He's adorable. <laughs> and he's Ugly. got blonde hair. Old man. Oh, of course. Yeah, that's, that's the bomb. Look at this. But their kid will probably have rock hair. Right. That's not sad. Well, <laughs> should I be saying these things on YouTube? <laughs> What things? <laughs> having a black-haired child would be sad. I don't think at all that having a black-haired child would be sad. Wait, ready? Wait, wait, wait. I want to get a. I want to get a picture of it. Wait, we gotta move in. I know. I'm really slow with my camera work, but I want legs, though. Just do Lucas's legs. Did you just notice, guys, that her socks are mismatched? We did that. Up. Right. Because the mismatched socks are. Just Sweet. Okay. See, that's the kind of science experiment I like. It yeah. cleans itself up. We actually did that in our library co-op once, and um, the one kid held his hand on it too long, and the orange stuff shot up and stuck to the ceiling. It was hilarious. <laughs> and it was there for, like, years. There's, like, the orange glaze that, there. That years. is actually pretty terrible. It was great. Let's go outside and play together, because we've done all our jazz now. So, play Space Explorer. Can we play with Lucas? Lucas, come. Come with us. Also, it's cold outside, and she can't go out in shorts on a t-shirt. That's great. Actually, that's very realistic to a child. I don't know. I, I went outside in, like, full snowsuits. Really? Yeah. See, with me, I found that most children won't necessarily bundle up unless you, like, tell them to. See, I was that way if we were going somewhere and I needed to bring a jacket, but I forgot. And mom was like, where are your mittens and your jacket? And I'm like, I have a jacket, but I don't have mittens. And she's like, no, you need mittens. And I'm like, oh, okay. <laughs> it's just things I don't think about. Yeah. Which is fine. Dude, he falls apart real fast. Well, okay. She's, she's struggling a little bit, but she's doing good. All right. Darling, it is 9 o'clock. It's time to come in here and actually do something. Um, do we have food in here? Richard, did you eat all of the food? Oh, I think he did. Wow, dude. So, we'll just get her to have a ham and cheese sandwich. It's fine. Does anyone else say sandwich? Because I do all the time. Sandwich. 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 Nobody actually says sandwich when they say it back. Yeah, but when sandwich. you say it slow... You do. Sandwich. It's a sandwich. Right, but when you say it fast, you say sandwich. See, I pronounce my D's. I just say sandwich. Not on purpose. Just, it's the way it comes out. Alright, are you done being a terrible adult? Well, if you think about it, he might not yet be an adult. That's true. Well, 17 is close enough. At least he cleaned up his own bowl. Remember that. I told him to. Oh, okay. <laughs> he gets no points. Girl is Where stanky. is he going? He's going to the bathroom. Is there a sink? There is a sink. What are you doing? Richard's having a bit of a crisis. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> is it creepy if we chat with Lucas? Oh. Okay, well, we can't chat with Lucas. I want to... Can we call the sadness hotline? Because our sister has stuff to do and he can't really talk to her right now. Call the sadness hotline. Be happy, my friend. 
be happy. What is the sadness hotline? It's where all the depressed people go to talk about their problems that nobody really cares about. Or at least the people on the other end of the, the sadness hotline don't care. <laughs> Can you imagine if that was your job, just having to sit there and listen to people's problems all day? It depends on what mood I would in. If I was in a good mood, I would sympathize. But if I was in bad mood, I'd be like, "Person, deal with it." I don't know that I ever. Life is life. I don't know that I'd ever be in the mood to deal with that though. That's if you have a rough. problem, you're complaining about it. Fix it. If you can't fix it, don't worry about it. Play in the Jets. Let's play in the Jets, dude. That's manners. Cool. Yeah, well, cleaning up gives them good manners, so we need her to do lots of cleaning. Oh, that's so cute. Are Siblings you... are so like. <laughs> you just did the exact same thing. Are you gonna go cry? You can't go to sleep before your sister. She's in the tub. You need to be responsible, Richard. What are you doing with your life? Go to the bathroom, and then we're gonna go tuck in your sister after she's done her bath. Her ball. Also, I dig men in sleepwear with white shirts. Is Honestly, that creepy? Same. Like, I like that look. But not like loose white shirts. Right, like more form fitting. Like, yeah, a more of a fitted t shirt. Like, yes, not for same. Okay, that was the momentary slip we had. <laughs> <laughs> that was a trail of thought. Forgive us, guys. Are you having a problem? Yes, you are having a problem. I see that you're having a problem. It's fine. So, will he age <laughs> eventually? Um, I think I have aging turned off. No, I don't. He won't. Yep. About 13 days. So our goal was to get her aged up, right? Yeah. Don't you dare leave your sister hanging! Don't be one of those big brothers. I won't have it. That's not you. Where are you, dear? We yeah. made you to be a good big brother. Now be one! Right. Dude, I so wish I could change that fact. Right? I need Wonder Woman's talents. <laughs> Does she change like that anymore? I don't think Does so. She spin around no, me? no. I think she puts. There's a dramatic music in the background as she places on her armor and stuff. Oh, that's boring. Yeah. Because in the seventies, she'd like spin around and change in her outfit. It was great. You've never seen seventies Wonder Woman. Go do it. It's not the best of any show I've ever seen, but, you know, it's fine. Gotta love classics, though. Classics? I don't watch anything but classics. Classics are the best. Crazy. No wonder we weren't going super speed! Lucas was still here! <laughs> <laughs> Lucas! He stayed until, like, 4 a.m. Lucas, that's creepy! Oh, she's gonna talk to her little dude. <laughs> Oh, that's so cute. Alright, um, we need to get a skill up to level 4. So, are we going to get rid of Creepy Lucas? or? No? Oh, he left. It's fine. Um, what skill do we want to get up? Uh, men Mental? Mental. Okay. Up here, my dear. I need you to wait. Is she? She is doing her extra credit without being told. What a queen. Did that saying go out, like, six months ago? Like, last year? Is yep. she taking notes in her book? Yeah. Did We're homeschoolers. That's what we do. <laughs> <laughs> you said you didn't take notes. Well, no, but you write in the math book. Is that math? It's all of them in one. So it's... it's that is one thin anyway. book. <laughs> right? I wish my school was that thin. I got piles... From the floor to my head full of history books. And it's yeah, all great. I didn't though, so I guess I was a very oh. blessed student. <laughs> a little faster. So Is he making French toast? Sister. He's making oh. eggs and toast. And not doing very good, apparently. How do you burn toast like that, dude? Why do you make toast like that? Okay, that was... Shh. That is way too much salt, bro. <laughs> was it salt or was it pepper? It was white. Was it? Girl, 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 girl. You gotta take your homework with me. Also, do you have that in your inventory? You have your volcano. Okay, good. Now you make it. Did you finish your extra credit? I don't know. I feel like you did. No, you didn't. Okay, cool. Sweet. Nice. Can you sell that? You don't need it. 
Wait, how did we get 23,000? Did we get that yesterday? Or last part? Yesterday. Did we get that in the last part? I don't remember. I thought we started with nothing. Let's watch a movie. Let's watch Lost Dog's Journey for some inspiration in our animal book. Because you need some fun. Someone's calling. That's the principal. We don't pick up the phone when the principal calls. <laughs> Because he's just going to tell us, yo, you didn't come to school. And we'll be like, yeah, we know. He says, we have a little sister to care for. But we're not going to tell you that because we don't want our dad to get arrested. Let's watch the movie. What's this about? The dog? Yeah, the puppy's journey or the dog's, dog's journey. long journey or something yeah. like that. White screen. Oh, look, there's the dog. Ah, I love his collar. Wait, that's a lie. You can't put collars on puppies. Actually, wait, that's Sims 3. I wouldn't know about Sims 3. I didn't play Sims 3. It's a kitty! Ah! No, he's gonna run away! Oh, she's gonna cry! Oh, Why no! Why would you leave the gate open? <laughs> he's little. We gotta forgive him a little bit. I'm not sure if his dog is cute or ugly. I can't tell. Oh, okay. The movie was interrupted, kids. The principal's visit. Today, the principal is visiting Bora's class, probably asking her why her brother never shows up to school. Probably. <laughs> Everyone is to be on their best behavior and not interrupt the lesson. Unfortunately, I need to swallow. The kid sitting behind her has decided to pelt her with something. Should she ignore it? And I'll read one of these eventually. Should she ignore it or ask the kid to stop? Ignore it. Especially if the principal's there and then he gets in trouble. Bora keeps her eyes trained dutifully on the board, hoping the kid will stop. Instead, the kid fires a ball of paper so hard it rolls to the teacher's feet. For once, somebody else gets in trouble, and Bora gets to look innocent and studious. Nice. What's going on? We're now in the desert. Oh, now we're in a town. Is it a sad movie? <laughs> Are we having fun? That was really the only goal. Is there grass underneath their table? Yes, it is, because we fancy. Can we? I want copy. grass underneath <gasps> my table. Dude, we can. Yes, we created a copy. Nice. Now, can we sell the book? Yes, we can. I gotta find the mailbox, because I don't know where it is. Okay. I still don't know where it is. Where is the mailbox? Do we not have one? We should. What is this? This, this All right, atrocity. while we're looking for the mailbox, dude, you need to go up and write another book. Um, I, I'm thinking of the most random things that come out of my head. How about something lost? A lost bow? Like, on her head bow? Sure. Oh, my good grief. The, oh. <laughs> <laughs> the lost bow. How about the lost hair bow? Because hair bows are important sometimes. No, that's a lie. I can survive with just a hair tie. There you go. Now we need to find the mailbox. Mailbox, mailbox. Where for art it? thou mail? Wait, yes, it is. Why is it not the? It's not the back door. No, I guess maybe it's on the front. Maybe we just have the wrong Oops. side. That's not what I want to do. Can we? I want to publish it. Oh, maybe because that's the copied one. Wait, I'm confused. Did we put that in? We do it now? Oh, there we go. Because it was the copy month. Okay, got it. Search for glittery gems. Oh, he leveled up. Three. Woo! Okay, we can now write short stories and excuse notes for other sims. Also read nonfiction books for reference and discuss favorite book or authors with other sims. Did you finish? I forbid you to do anything else but finish that book. Grind, my man. Grind. It is crunch time, brother. There is a deadline. <laughs> well, there's not, but... My deadline. We need cash before the next 20 years, so... When's Friday? We need $2,000. A long time from now, it's Tuesday. <laughs> Dude. Why is he crying? Is your book it. sad? <laughs> Well, she lost her hair bow. Oh, that's so, true. So, yeah, it is. I know she's stressed out. Well, honey bunny, you can. Let's turn on some hip-hop. 
That's good. Get over here and dance your little heart away. Go dance. Did you finish? Nice. Alright, so we're going to get you to come right here and publish. Actually, wait. Make a copy. We're going to have all of these. We're going to give them all to Bora. This is the new one. Alright. Um, I need you to... To create a copy. So we do lose a little bit of money when we do that, but it just needs to be done. It's so cute. He's got a key. Like, really bad. We'll let the man go to the bathroom. No, we're going to publish this book first. <laughs> it needs to be done. We need to make an income. So search for glittery gems. Oh, they're probably splitting in the group. And then self publish. War the Bunny, the Lost. Hair bow. We're on the road to fame, apparently. We're gonna be famous. Alright, um. Are you done being stressed? Oh, you're eating. A responsible bean. Let's put her volcano right smack dab in the middle of the coffee table so all our guests can see how brilliant our little sister is. Yes. Richard, do something. Don't wet the floor, please. <laughs> we don't wanna have to wash the pants. It's fine. Alright, then this boy needs to have a chit chat. It's really the next thing on the list. Um, yeah, honestly, we should probably stop. Although we could go a little longer since we don't get to record too terribly long. Let's tell a funny story. Let's talk to our sister because we need so much help. So much help. Share a secret. Tell a story. She's about face. She's got a pretty face. Wow. Rude. Uh, oh, give a gift. Ooh. Give her the book. Give her the books. Give her the books you wrote for her. Why is that not going up? It better be going up. Comedy skill. Why the comedy skill? The funny boy. It's a little loony sometimes. That's probably why he's funny. Uh, There's a secret about a banana peel. Uh -huh. Put a banana peel in the principal's desk. <laughs> or like underneath his roller chair. So he stood up, he went BAM! Right after the desk. This is a story. A dramatic story. It had bears and explosions. Well, there you know it's going to be a good story. Were the bears causing the explosions, or were the explosions meant for the bears? Well, we're not exploding the bear. That's sad. The bear probably caused it. By accident? No. <laughs> On purpose. He's going to take over the human Ooh, world. Ooh, become best friends! Empathy. Acquired skill. Yay! Ah! so cute! I actually love these videos. They're so cute. Can we give her her other book? Because I think we only gave her the one. Yeah, give her the other one. Yeah, boy. Like, we wrote two books for me. You're probably talking about her presents. Uh, ooh, this one's orange. Nice. Ah! It's so cute. Okay, now, sweetie pie, can you put that away, please? Clean that up. That did nothing for our social. Dude, and it's 7 p.m. already. No, it did do something for our social. Oh, that's her social, then. No, 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 the other one. You see, our social, our social's all the way down here. Right, we did not enough, let's be honest. All right. Um, teach a valuable lesson. Do we have valuable lessons? Yes, we do. Don't okay. be like me. <laughs> That'd be him saying that. Don't be like me. Master Cloud Days. I think that gets up for social. Maybe. The Simmers. Secret weapon after the cloud gaze. It sounds because it gets other fun and they're social. Oh, why don't they talk to the fish? Is that social? I don't know if they can talk to the fish. I think he's just there. You put uh, him in the inventory or rename him. That's, he's just there. okay. He is letting off green fumes. That is not a good sign. Mm -hmm. If your boy is giving off green fumes, he's got a problem. Yeah. Thumbnail opportunity. Oh, he's there. Stinky boy. Okay, there's always title opportunities too. <laughs> Just getting anything done? Yes, it is. Creativity level two. Oh, that's cute. We should get him a table at some point. But we want to buy a house first. 
So I don't. I actually don't know where we got this. I don't. Was either. there some furniture that we sold? Well, we did sell the furniture. There was some. I think there was some furniture that we sold, but then we kind of got some nicer furniture. I don't know. You know what? I don't think we cheated it, so we're not gonna get rid of it. All right, we need to put this girl in bed. Where are you going? Stop. Put your sister to bed, and then you can do whatever on earth you want. Including taking a shower. Well, he was going to do that, so good for him. Into bed. This is honestly expensive. Ah, I gave her a good night kiss! Okay, and everyone dies. Okay. <laughs> Next. Why do you have to be hungry? He is a teen male. Chips. They are always hungry. That's true. Look at those pants. He's so stylish. Right. Okay, go to bed. It's 1.30 in the morning. What? Go okay. Oh, I can't do that. I'm sorry. Go to bed, noob. Go to bed! <laughs> Alright, alright, hold on. We're gonna pause this real quick and paint that wall. <laughs> I <laughs> need to paint the wall. Bang. Wall is painted. Alright. Um, we're gonna get him in bed. And we're gonna end this part here. Um, we got some books published today. We got a school project. Good. We got our grade up. So, why are we always ending the episode when they're sleeping? Because it just is a good pause. We ended it on him sleeping last time. So now we're gonna get her sleeping. We're creepy. Well... That doesn't sound... Oh, she's dreaming about her mom, too. Oh, that's horrible. All right. Um, anyhow, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. Leave all your comments, feedback, and suggestions in the comments down below. Thank you, for Charles, for joining me again. No problem. And, oh, she's awake. All right. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye, guys.